Hi, this is Piotr Garley and this is Inspirations for Presentations. As always, I focus on simplicity, so let's make it as simple as possible. In this series of videos, I show you how you can easily create visually appealing slides for your business or sales presentation. Before we get started, please click the like button, subscribe to our channel and click the bell. Also, remember to subscribe to my free training on simple business presentations. You can find the link in the description. Today I'm gonna show you how you can easily improve such a boring and outdated slide. It's a smart art. Doesn't look good. There's a very little chance anyone will pay attention to such a visualization. So let's make it a lot more visually appealing, but at the same time, simple. Yes, simplicity is the key. So first, let's get rid of this unnecessary arrow. What about this visual? Do you like it? I don't. So I convert this smart art into a more simple element. We can change it here and convert it to text or shapes. I will change that to a plain text. That's it. This is a good start for formatting this slide now. Now I insert a big circle inside the slide. Remember to press down the shift button so that it will be a fully symmetrical circle. I send it back and I copy and paste another circle, but this time I want it to have only an outline. Just like that. I make it a bit bigger and place it outside the green one. And here's the whole magic I want to make. I insert a rectangle that will hide a part of my yellow circle. It's a piece of cake. You just change its color to white and bring the green circle and the text to front. And that's the effect. Look here. We can resize the white rectangle and it will reduce or increase the size of the visible part of the yellow circle. That's the magic. Simple, right? We can achieve this result in a couple of different ways. Using for example an arc shape, but I think this manner is the simplest one. So I stick to this. What next? I insert a couple of small circles. A kind of dots with white thick outline and they will be placed on the yellow circle. a few horizontal lines connected to these small circles. We can adjust the colors, we can use a couple of different colors on a slide, but I like to stick to the narrow color palette so that I have more control on what elements my audience focuses on. So this is my color choice. This is good, I like it. Now I group these elements and align them so that they would be distributed on the yellow circles evenly. Now I will shorten these lines to the guide which is visible in the middle of the slide. And now some text arrangements.
this is a good slide. Simple, nice and clear. But we can do something more. We can add icons. Let's find them inside the PowerPoint icon library. We could place them somewhere here, but that would not be the best choice. I will place these icons on separate circles. Yes, we've got lots of circles on the slide, but that's fine. And voila, this is my final result. Was it difficult? I hope not. And I believe anyone can make it. All you have to do is to take some time and some effort, but it's not that difficult. It's quite simple, right? How do you like this slide? Please leave a comment and share your thoughts. Thank you for watching. Please remember to go to my free training. It's a simple training on how to start your presentation with. You can find the link in the description. You can also start following me on Twitter. If you want to master your presentation skills, check out my course Professional PowerPoint Presentations. It is a concise and thorough course for anyone willing to become master of business type presentations. Are you a manager and want to speed up your work with presentations? Or willing to impress your boss and clients with stunning presentations? go to the link in the description. Want some more tips and tricks? Subscribe and stay tuned.